possibly even, according to some biologists, man. Robin Baker from Manchester University claims to have found an area of magnetic sensitivity in the human head and has shown that we too may be able to navigate by the Earth's magnetic field. According to Robin Baker, our magnetic centre is in the sinus region, just about here. So it looks like the old call to follow your nose may have something to it after all. So now we probably know how our salmon follow their noses from Greenland across thousands of miles of open ocean to the river of their birth to spawn. And though we know precious little about their life at sea, we know quite a lot about their life at home. You know, I think this is going to be a bit of a, an unusual day out if Basil's anything to go by. And if you want a clue as to where we are, Basil is a Shropshire ram. Hello, and a very happy Christmas to you all. For the next hour or so, I will be joined by some old and some new friends to bring you some music that I hope that you will enjoy. Do you remember beehive hairdos? layers of net petticoats and winkle picker shoes. I do. Now hold on just a minute. Do you mean to tell me that this seal just said hello there three times? Let's see that again. Well, believe it or don't, it's true. Hoover, a 10-year-old harbor seal at the New England Aquarium in Boston, is the first known talking seal anywhere. People stand amazed around Hoover's pool, and Hoover just laughs at them. <laughs> 